Mom, Mythic Rare here, and yep, we're on the bandwagon. Um, Alex and I went to Five Below a few weeks ago, and we saw these crystal creations. Um, in other words, diamond painting by another name, but I think that these little $5 kits are kind of an interesting way, also a very budget-friendly way, to try out diamond painting, but you don't have to break the bank in order to do it. So, um, let's get right on into it, shall we? Um, actually, before I rip into this packaging, uh, let's probably take a look and see what comes on it. So it includes over 2,000 crystals, a, oh, here we go, a stylus, a gem tray, and a beetle canvas, because I'll do the beetle ones first. So if we flip it over to the back, we can already see it has 12 colors. Um, extend back, stand to display. Ooh, interesting. So spend a relaxing afternoon creating a dazzling, dazzlingly beautiful piece of art with Crystal Creations. Crystallizing by number allows you to unwind while you create something beautiful. Allow the hours to melt away as you simply apply crystals one by one creating a twinkling image of shimmering perfection. So first you're going to read the chart on the right. It lists each crystal tray number and corresponding symbol, which matches the canvas. And you'll just pick a color to start. Peel back the silicone gums protective plastic film. Ooh, that's interesting. They called it gum, okay. Um, Wax by another name and press the tip into the stylus so that a small amount of wax remains within the stylus nib. Repeat this process with the wax until it begins to lose its stickiness. Use the stylus to press the wax onto the rounded side of your crystal of choice, picking it up. Gently peel back the protective film and expose the adhesive. Firmly press the flat side of the crystal onto one of the corresponding symbols for that shade of the canvas. The crystal will stick to the canvas. Repeat with each shade until your canvas is completed and then this is going to be the end result. And of course, warning, small parts, it's a choking hazard, and that's why it's saying recommended eight years of age or up. Highly agree with that. Okay. So I know that like, oh, hello, there is tape there. Um... Just a second while I get scissors. So I know that like, by looking at the demographics, some of y'all are not from the States and you're probably wondering, um, what is Five Below? Five Below is this, um, is like one of our like budget friendly chains here in America. They have like, they have things that are going to start at a dollar, uh, stuff like that, or like sometimes even candy, it'll be like 50 cents or whatever inside the store. And then like the most expensive that things will be are like around $5, sometimes more, like they're actually starting to have some more expensive things Ooh. but yeah like five below is the budget friendly store so this is our toolkit we get a fancy single placer i love that that is cute we get a little white boat pink plate of wax and then here are our drills 
which like on the back in the advertisement, it seemed like they were almost in like kitted up in what appeared to be the oh what is it called those little containers for harbor freight like it seemed to have been put into one of those so like my personal suggestion is um that could mislead people thinking that they're getting a whole uh storage system with it but they're not so just you know Maybe just show the gems and the actual, like, tray that it comes with. So here is our canvas. It is, like, legitimately a canvas, canvas that has been um, mounted to some cardboard. And then, oh, okay, I see. So we have a way to... Uh, stand this up. Okay, so it'll... If we extend that flap on the back, it is supposed to stand up. Oh, okay, I see. So, like, this will have to take and go like this. And then, okay, so then this will not fold and then it'll stand up like that. Oh, that's cute. Like, it'll be, it'll be cute, you know, for a little kid's room. Like the butterflies, the beetles, like probably more for a little boy's room, but still, you know. Like, that is actually really cute. And then there's our plastic. It's um, not, like, too thin, but it's not too thick either. It's decent. And then our sticky isn't, like, Diamond Art Club levels is strong, but it's not, like... You stick it down and the drill is going to go flying either, at least, I don't think. But this is probably something where you're going to want to seal it before you either frame it or you use that back stand to display it. So there's that. And then this... This does not twist off. Like, I'm pulling on it decently hard. It does not twist off. This is all, like, one single uniform piece with a single placer in it. So, you will probably want to grab another pen if you're going to multi-place. And then, here is our wax. You'll want to peel back that plastic on the wax, otherwise... When you dip your pen in it, nothing happens. And then here are our colors. These are actually in, uh, they actually follow the DMC, which is nice. So 791, 3837, 951, 964. 604, 601, 444, 3850, 208, 348, 721, and 322. All right, time for the blue crystal creations okay and we're back with the blue crystal creations again over 2000 crystals and this is going to be the butterflies and the mushrooms 
which I think is like super cool because mushrooms are like totally in right now. Um, so that's our schematic. And then the same exact instructions on the very back of the box. I'm not going to go over that again. Um, but yeah, if you can like look super duper close, see how they already have this like, like in a container of some sort. And this looks like one of those uh, Harbor Freight containers. I think that it would be uh, much better if Hinker, um, the people who make these sets, or Hinkler Creations, uh, actually makes them with the tools that are included in the kit. Like, instead of having some outside storage, maybe like have the white boat in there because for some folks who are brand new to the craft, they may think that they're getting something extra inside the package, but they're really not. And then as I had found out a second ago, there is tape on the side of these. Or you know what? If uh, they do not want to redo their uh, product shot, something else that they can put is just a little blurb storage kit not included um anyways that is probably like my top uh critical comment about these little kits from five below i absolutely think that they are adorable So here we go, we have another canvas mounted to some cardboard, and then you'll just push, you'll like, again, peel this back, and then this pushes down, it latches, so then you can have it stand up on its own. Wax, our blue pen, and then our boat, and let's see what colors come in this one. Three, eight, three, seven, seven, three, nine, three, one, eight, four, nine five nine one five five seven forty three seven ninety one seven forty one six zero four seven one eight six zero five and three two two you know something else that i've noticed about oh okay Never mind, because at first I thought that that was going to be like a diamond painting, diamond painting, but if y'all are confused, if you take a look at that, that is the side of the box for the other kit, the one with all the beetles. So like, yeah, see like the purple edge and then the purple edge and then this one right here. So... Yeah, in case any of y'all were looking at that and, like, were confused, um, please worry not. Like, you saw how I just, you know, figured out where that came from. But, uh, yeah. Your legend is going to be right here. Also, I don't know if any of y'all noticed, but your legend is also on the drill baggies itself. So I think that if you are not one for keeping the box out and stuff, it'll probably be better to go just like cross country style on these kits. So for example, I snip open bag number one 
and then I peel back my plastic and then I look for all the places that have a number one. So like in the flower leaf right here, like I put down all of my number one, number one, like number one until I'm done with this and then cut open your next color, number two, and then you're going to do all the number twos on here. I mean, if you want to keep the box and then you go and you look at your uh, legend on the box again, that is totally fine. Uh, there is no right way or wrong way to diamond paint. But if I was going to sit down right now and do this kit, that is exactly how I would do it because this thing is so small. It's not even a full drill. It's a partial. I would just straight up go cross country style because that's not going to be um, a very big mental burden so <laughs> but if you feel like you need to kit up those are the two places where you can find your legend so then you can just write down on some sticky labels what goes with what So yeah, that is it, y'all. I hope that you enjoyed Crystal Creations. And if you like what I'm doing as a creator, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. If you've seen me more than once today and you like my stuff, please hit the subscribe. And we will see y'all later. Bye!